pot is cropping up in New Jersey. Heather Hatton joins us to tell us about the progress of New Jersey's medical marijuana law. We're finally actually getting some progress there. You, you mentioned in your story, of course, um, there's a 5,000 square foot facility somewhere in Jersey. We don't right. know where. We're effectively, I guess, the first contractor Correct. is growing his crop that will be available for medical right. marijuana and users. And finally is the right word here. I mean, this law was passed way back in January 2010, and it's, t it's been a bumpy road since. So both locally, a lot of towns said, heck no, we don't want pot growing in our towns. And then also federally, the Obama administration has been more, um, put more scrutiny on this process. Governor Christie ultimately decided to go forward. And uh, this is the first provider that is now growing uh, mar medical marijuana in a facility in northern New Jersey. They won't disclose the location, but it will be dispensed in Montclair. Okay. Now, of course, the shot we saw there a second ago was not pot in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. uh, but we do, we, now, now what's interesting here is that we don't, th there's really only one supplier here. There, there are others that have been set up, yeah, so but far. they just aren't, haven't, haven't started growing? Yeah, so there's six uh, providers who got licenses. Uh, the Greenleaf, the one in Montclair, is furthest along. They're the only ones who are now growing. What's, what's holding them up? Uh, a lot of it is location. So like I said, towns don't want them to set up there. Um, but there is another provider in South Jersey that is uh, finishing the very extensive background checks. New Jersey is really trying to be a model of a more secure uh, form of this, not like Colorado or California. So they put uh, the providers through about six to seven months of background checks. Um, what, what are the differences, by the way, about with California and, Ca and Colorado as opposed to Jersey? This is much more of a medical marijuana model where it's prescription-based. So licensed doctors who sign up to do this uh, prescribe it to patients. So the list of about 100 doctors who have agreed to participate is already out. The patient registry is now going to be out in August, and so the doctors will actually prescribe this medicine. As opposed to California and Colorado where? It's a lot looser in terms of how you get it. Um, so it's not a medical doctor-based model as much as New Jersey. Okay. Um, but what will be interesting is the economics of this. So at this point, we're not really sure how many One patients. One supplier, he could have nice pricing power now. Right. Um, so we're not really sure how many patients are interested. The state says several hundred. Um, but until we have that patient registry, we don't really know how many are going to be buying this. So the first Montclair provider is only growing on a limited basis. Um, the second one is much more bullish. They hope to uh, grow 2,000 plants and have a million dollars in capital for this. So Great. Could be very interesting. Thanks so much for joining us okay. this morning, Heather. Okay, thank you.